everyone welcome to my channel today for my first face-to-face -face video i actually wanted to show you all of my current favorite syrups that i've been liking at the moment as seasons change you know and different type of holidays come about my taste and my syrup preferences change of course but right now for the springtime i've been really gravitating towards these and using them a lot in my reels and just in my everyday coffees the two brands that i'm going to be talking about today is just tirani and monin I've tried other brands, I have other brands in my collection as well, but these are the ones that I've been gravitating towards most, so let's get started. First we're going to start off with Monin, and just really basic and classic is the French Vanilla. I've enjoyed this syrup so much, I do cold foams with it, I do, you know, like the hot foams with it as well, I do iced lattes, hot lattes, matcha, this is all just, this is overall really good to have, so if you're wanting to add any sort of vanilla syrups to your collection from Onin, they do a really good French vanilla. Next is actually one that I discovered around fall time that I've been gravitating towards around the spring is hazelnut. I'm very picky when it comes to hazelnut and caramel um, syrups you'll see but um, I really enjoy this one. This one I've only tried in hot and iced lattes but it's really good to have and just great overall to add to your collection. Next is Monin's Caramel. I'm very picky when it comes to caramel, as I mentioned earlier. I They can't be too artificial. It has to taste kind of true to caramel. And the only caramel coffee that I actually really enjoy is from Dunkin'. So it's kind of hard to recreate at home when I'm very picky with it. But this one's really good. I've only tried this with hotter iced lattes. I haven't done a cold foam with it, but more of like these type of, I want to say more syrupy flavors and darker flavors, I tend to just stick with my lattes. Next is a flavor that I've tr tried in the past like two years and I've really been enjoying and I wanted to try Monin, Butter Pecan. I really enjoy this syrup, hot or ice, but I think specifically more hot, I want to say. I'm always torn, but this one's really good to have. You know, you have like that butteriness and also like that saltiness that the syrup gives. Um, I have both brands. You'll see that I'm going to show you Tarani's later as well, but these are really, really good to have and just overall great to add to your collection if you're just starting off. Next is going to be one that's really fun for the spring and summer. It's Monin Strawberry Rose. I did not expect to like it as much as I did. It's very refreshing. You definitely taste the strawberry. The rose comes towards the end, but it's not overpowering. I've had syrups that are just rose flavored that have been a little bit too strong or too much of like that artificial taste, but this one's really good. I use this in my matchas. I've done cold foams. I do hotter iced lattes with these as well. So it's really good to have and just something great overall if you want something fun for the spring and summer. Next, we're gonna move on to Tarani. So one syrup that Tarani offers that's really fun is vanilla salt. This one's so good. If you want something sweet and something salty, this one's really good to have. I do cold foams, hotter iced lattes, matcha. Vanilla is overall really fun and really easy to play with. Even macchiatos, if I'm running out of just a basic vanilla syrup, I'll use this. So this one's really good, and if you're looking for something salty and sweet, super, super good to have in your collection. Next, as I mentioned, I love butter pecans, so I've also loved Tarani's. It's very hard for me to pick from both brands, but they're so good to have. As you can see, this one, I'm pretty, I'm like more than halfway done with it. This one, I gravitate towards just a little bit more because I just got Monin's butter pecan not that long ago, but this one, again, so good to have. Very hard to pick between two brands, but I always, always, always love having at least one in stock. Next is a newer flavor that I've tried from Tarani this year, and it's cheesecake. It sounds, it sounded a little weird, but oh my goodness, this with strawberry syrup or sauces, anything you can pair this with, it gives it a really good saltiness to it. I feel like this is what I expected. Tarani has a syrup called shortbread, like what I expected that to taste like, but this one's really good. I have this, I'm going to always keep this in my collection. But um, if you're looking for a really fun flavor to try to give a little bit more of saltiness to your drinks, this one's really good. Next syrup from Tarani is chocolate chip cookie dough. I tried this last year, so good to have. I really enjoyed this one a little bit more iced than I do hot, but this one's good to have in like your iced lattes. I haven't tried it in matcha, but um, this one's just really good if you want something chocolatey, but then something salty. It's like, it brings a really overall good flavoring to your lattes. And again, I've had this hot and iced. Last but not least is Tarani's, I feel like famous, very popular um, sauce. It's caramel. Again, I enjoy this. I'm very picky, so I enjoy this with hotter iced lattes, uh, you know, drizzled on top, making macchiatos. I haven't done, I don't believe I've done like a cold foam with it just because it is a little bit thicker and it's hard to kind of mix in. 
it mixes in and dissolves really well with hot lattes and then with your iced lattes you'll obviously drizzle it in the cup if you want but this is really good to have in your collection thank you again so much for joining me in today's video i'm super excited to get my new journey started here on youtube i did want to mention so all the spouts that i use for my syrups i actually get them from amazon and they're just little spouts like this and they come with like the little tip and i like it because you can kind of pour measure out and it also has like a cap so you don't have to worry like, like dust in it and stuff so i recommend that or any type of spa i always make sure that any of my syrups are covered just to avoid like them going bad faster or anything like that and also from my understanding we don't have to refrigerate these so they actually stay on my bar at all times i have a bigger collection well i didn't want to go into too much detail with it because i just wanted to show what i'm currently using as well and i've used other brands as well um, right now i have like 1883 I have a Ghirardelli sauce, I use, I have Da Vinci, and I believe that's all that I have at the moment right now. I'm at a syrup no buy, but I do have just two coming in pretty soon that I'll show on my Instagram. All of my, all of the details that you need are going to be down below, all of my socials. Um, I usually buy my syrups directly from Monino Tarani's website, Amazon. I'll try to do, Amazon I only do the 1883 syrups because those are a little bit harder to find. And I've also used SeriousSips.com for some of my 1883 syrups and a Da Vinci syrup that I got during Valentine's Day, which is like a red velvet cake one. So any, all the information is going to be down below. Make sure to follow me and subscribe. I really appreciate you being here and I hope you have a great day.